when a child acts out depending on their age mostly it's a case of them seeking connection there's a difference between seeking attention and connection often we label it as them seeking attention go deeper than attention ask why are they seeking attention are they not getting enough attention right and it is not that they're not getting attention but they're not getting enough connection a feeling of being connected to your caregiver is absolutely vital in order for you to want to explore the world around you without feeling scared that the caregiver is going to leave you or secondly that the world is a place to be feared apart from that they then sprout out to want to extend themselves in a social circle and that's when a child begins to socialize when they begin to understand social interactions in a time like now when we have just come out of a pandemic a lot of our children have suffered for the lack of socialization for the lack of social skills because they've had to be kept in a certain way and they will not know how to interact they will not know what our boundaries are they will not know what is socially acceptable and this is where patience is called for for anyone holding the space for these children that please don't let these children get lost in the system instead as an educator as a caregiver use this as an opportunity for you to make a difference that's going to be a lasting difference for a child for no reason of their own to have fallen into the clutches of not being able to socialize every single child is different we have highly sensitive children who will get overwhelmed when exposed to outside or exposed to other people places crowds it doesn't make them less needy or less age uh, less you know lesser of children acting at that age they still are acting that age or they still are very much a valid member of society except they feel more than us they feel more than the next person and all of this that they are taking on in a shorter space of time means that they need that much space to recover and these are children who are highly empathic highly sensitive who need someone who's going to take care of them or an educator that will have that capacity in them to have the empathy to be able to help these children and helping these children will also help in healing how we feel triggered by these children sometimes they might make us feel inadequate sometimes they might challenge us whatever it is it is something that you can get on top of and make it about the children because every child matters